A COLUMBUS TEEN IS OUT OF THE HOSPITAL TONIGHT AND OPENING UP TO NBC4 AFTER HE WAS ROBBED AND BEATEN UNCONSCIOUS. GOOD EVENING, EVERYONE. I'M COLLEEN MARSHALL. AND I'M MIKE JACKSON. THE 13-YEAR-OLD VICTIM SAYS HE WAS BEATEN OVER A PAIR OF SHOES. THE TEENAGER AND HIS MOTHER SPOKE EXCLUSIVELY WITH TYLER CARTER TONIGHT AND SHE HAS THEIR STORY. TYLER? Yeah, 13-year-old Aiden Winter, he tells me he's feeling much better tonight after he was severely beaten. The teen was beaten pretty badly and suffered a concussion. He says the first attacker was someone he thought was his friend. I mowed grass for my boss for about a month. 13-year-old Aiden Winter says he was so excited to buy his first pair of Air Jordan shoes. These sneakers you see here, a $150 pair of Air Jordan Sons of Mars. Aiden bought three months ago after working to buy them in the summer. This past Sunday, Aiden, his sister, and friend well, actually, were walking to the store in West Columbus when he saw who he thought was an old friend. When I walked over there, he was like, Hey, I like your shoes. I was like, Thanks. He was like, they real? I was, he was like, they can't be. I was like, they are. That's when Aiden says the boy, along with nine others, started to attack him. They started kicking me and punching me. All I heard, my sister was like, don't take it, don't take it. Cries that went unheard until a voice called out to call the police. They stopped, took my shoe off, checked my pockets and ran. In these pictures taken after the attack, you can see cuts and bruises to his head and face, injuries that still remain visible today. Right now, I feel fine, but earlier I was in a lot of pain. His mother, Erica Winter, is just happy her son is alive. Told him to get Chuck Taylors. <laughs> Some Converse. Safe. Absolutely. I mean, I just don't think that, I think that all of this with tennis shoes is mind boggling. I don't understand it. Aiden's mother says it could take a month until he's healed. Aiden tells me he, he will think twice about buying an expensive pair of shoes again. And Columbus police are asking anyone that has information on this incident to give them a call. In the studio, Tyler Carter, NBC4. Already, thanks so much, Tyler.